G'day guys, how are you? I'm just at the fields, beautiful day, very little wind. You can feel the wind suck, there's very little wind, it's barely blowing at all. So I've got the tundra here, that was my tundra flying. It's, um, um, it's flying absolutely beautifully at the moment. I had a mistake, oh, a mistake, it was a bit of a, yeah, it was my mistake, it was a stupid error. <clears throat> basically struggling to take off so it's stupid me decided to uh, just put the throttle down and keep going and the, the prop has hit the ground and and it ripped the front of the nose off so I've had to repair that and it's back up in the air again so that was the damage it done there I had to re-glue it on and but I have got a new prop I bought this off Hobby Wing it's just an Aerostar uh, 12 by 5 wooden prop just like to try it and just see what sort of flight times so far I believe it's not as, the flight times are a bit shorter with it on, but um, it seems to have a little bit more torque to it. So the other standard prop I think is the carbon fibre 12 by 6 so it's a little bit more torquier prop by the look. I run uh, APM, it's an old APM 2.6 on it. Flight controller, just a basic setup. Uh, running mission planner on the laptop here. Uh, full uh, wireless telemetry. And another thing I've also done, I've, I've converted my Tyrannus X9D Plus over to Edge TX. So sit back and enjoy the flight. This is just going to be a cruise flight around the field. Nothing spectacular, only because I don't trust the nose of the craft anymore. I'm going to get another body for it and we'll um, get it looking brand new again. I've flown this previously since the the nose incident. Basically, I tried a wooden prop. This is the prop that's on here now. It's a 10, it's a 12 by five. Hasn't quite got quite as much pitch to it, this prop. So it's added a little bit of weight to the front, which I don't know if that was part of the cause of the, the prop being dug into the grass, um, which, which rip the front cowling off but it's yeah, it's okay I don't think it's as efficient as the carbon fiber prop that comes with the Tundra V2 but it's not a bad second prop to, to have as well it does fly fine still absolutely glorious day today I must say it's um it's just uh, you can't get out on these sort of days and you just want to get out. It's a real pain because no wind, clear skies, awesome visibility. It's just per this perfect day to, um, yeah, to, to throw a, a bird up in the air and have a bit of a flight. So this craft too, I have got um, the camera that we're watching this out of it's a fox ear. I can't think of the name off the top of my head now. I'll put a put a link of it on the screen here. Um, but it, you can connect it up so it powers from the battery, which how, that's how I've got it connected up. And I've got a video transmitter too, which connects to it. So it's quite a good universal little camera, which I can swap from plane to plane if I want to. Just uh, it's just sitting on the top of the wing with some velcro that's it it's a stabilized camera too that's why you see the craft moving more than the, the horizon so it's not a bad little camera it does shoot in 4k I'm only shooting this in 1080p but yeah not a bad little camera I don't really fly this FPV, it's more um, line of sight flight, that's what I'm doing. But the option is there if I want to fly FPV, but um, I just find it's not as good. I prefer line of sight with this plane.
it's just so smooth this plane I, I love it it's it's just a nice plane to fly it's easy plane to fly you can fly it slow you can do acrobats with it too but I've have I don't bother with that I'm, I just prefer cruising around with it like I'm doing here doing some low low passes um, and getting it up to a bit of reasonable height too at times but it's just more of a more of a park flyer for me it's certainly worthy of having a better fuselage which is why I'm going to rebuild that And the landings, landings just beautiful on it. You can get it perfect. I'm, I'm not even using flaps either for takeoff or landing. It. So there you go, guys. That my cruise for the day or the morning in my Tundra. I just like to get it up and just yeah, enjoy the enjoy the clear day and looking at a, a plane flying behind a clear sky. It's beautiful. So I hope you enjoyed the video, guys. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you on the next one. Bye for now.